In the vast expanse of the cosmos, the James Webb Space Telescope has once again defied expectations. Astronomers peering through its advanced infrared eyes have uncovered something truly astonishing. Three enormous galaxies, known as the Red Monsters. These ancient behemoths existed when the universe was just a fraction of its current age, a mere 800 million years after the Big Bang. But here's the mystery. These galaxies are as massive as our Milky Way. According to current models of cosmology, structures like these shouldn't have formed so early. Their sheer size and rapid growth challenge our understanding of how galaxies evolve in the early universe. What makes these red monsters so intriguing is their ability to form stars at an unprecedented rate. Unlike most galaxies, which gradually convert their gas into stars over billions of years, these ancient giants burned through nearly 80% of their available gas within just a few hundred million years. That's a level of efficiency we simply weren't expecting. This raises an important question. What was fueling such extreme star formation? Was it an abundance of cold gas? Could there have been a different kind of physics at play in the early universe? These are the questions scientists are now racing to answer. The discovery was made possible thanks to JWST's cutting-edge infrared capabilities. Unlike visible light telescopes, which struggle to see distant galaxies due to cosmic dust, JWST can peer through these dense clouds. The red monsters appear as glowing red patches in its images, a result of their immense distance from us. When we observe these galaxies, we're essentially looking back in time, seeing them as they were over 12.8 billion years ago. At that moment, the universe was still in its early stages. Yet these galaxies had already formed billions of stars. This is where things get perplexing. In standard cosmology, galaxies take time to grow. They start small, with stars forming gradually. Yet these galaxies seem to have skipped that step entirely. They emerged fully grown, defying what we thought we knew about galaxy evolution. Their existence suggests one of two possibilities. Either our models of early galaxy formation are missing a crucial piece, or the universe was far more efficient at creating stars than we ever imagined. Could dark matter or unknown cosmic forces have played a role? These are mysteries that could reshape how we think about the universe's early years. For scientists, discoveries like these are both exciting and unsettling. Every new observation from JWST is forcing astronomers to rethink established theories. If massive galaxies like these could form so quickly, then perhaps the conditions of the early universe were far more favorable for rapid galaxy growth than we ever expected. This also raises another possibility. If the red monsters exist, could even larger, more ancient galaxies be hiding out there, just beyond JWST's reach? If so, our current models of the Big Bang and cosmic evolution may need a major revision. What makes this discovery even more exciting is that it's just the beginning. The James Webb Space Telescope has only been operational for a short time, and yet it has already rewritten so much of what we thought we knew. As it continues scanning the cosmos, it's likely will uncover even more surprises, perhaps galaxies even older or stranger than the red monsters. One thing is certain, our understanding of the universe is evolving with each new discovery. The red monsters are just one piece of the puzzle, a glimpse into a time when the cosmos was young and galaxies grew at impossible speeds. What else is out there waiting to be found? Only time and the sharp infrared eyes of JWST will tell.